succes! Good morning! One of the things with camping rurally is flies and mosquitoes. And I came across the perfect solution on YouTube. I just don't know if it will work for this van. Let's find out. All you need, duct tape, fly net, scissors, and good magnets. The problem is, they didn't have this. And it has to sit flush with the metal. So that could be a problem. But I think, in the end, it'll be better than nothing. Because Timo does need airflow at night. It's a little hot for a job like this, but the weather is not going to get better. So we better get started. First I'm going to go for the more or less size. Make sure I have plenty enough. Just to get an idea. Make sure it's flush. That should do. I cut way too big. Better safe than sorry. Tons of this stuff. It's also nice that I can leave the car open with Timo's inside, the windows down. He will have a safety belt, but this is extra. People will not cuddle him and stuff like it. Next job is these magnets. They're very strong. You hardly get them apart. But they're tiny. And they go on the edge. And I'm going to try to space them well because I have only 10 for each curtain. 10 for the other side, 10 for this side. So I'm going to space them out. Done. See, these are the ones we need. And those are the ones that just keep it in place. And they will go once I'm done. Now I have to duct tape over these lines, including the magnets into the duct tape. I hope it's good quality. Magnet. God, I hope this works. Doesn't look too promising. I don't want to get outside the door, otherwise I can't open and close it anymore with this fly net on. Don't worry about this being big, that gets cut off later. Just gently tuck it in place. The only thing I wonder about, what is the sun going to do with this tape? Is it going to ruin it quickly? <laughs> Not seeing it work yet. But we carry on. Here it's a little tricky. But I have no magnets there. I'm sure you can do a better job than I do. First layer of tape is on. I have to now carefully peel it off 
and put it upside down on a flat surface. First I have to find a flat surface. No creeps. Uh, oh, this will do. Little table. No spiders. Uh, I don't like spiders. Alright, let's go. They move already. They're too strong. Whoa. Upside down. Okay. Well, the idea is like this. Now I just have to sort of push them back in place. But I can still do that. Like here, they moved. This is not tidy. But it is what it should be. And once they're in place, we're going to put duct tape on this side. I don't know. Not looking too trustworthy to me yet. But we never know. Do the same. Make sure it sticks around the magnet and that it goes on top of the other one. I'm just not sure if this will work in the Turkish sun. I think my fly net is too flimsy. But we'll see. I hope to go camping next week. If it just holds a week, then I can buy better materials and do it again. And maybe Turkish duct tape is not what it's supposed to be. That wouldn't surprise me either. Glues are useless, so why not duct tape? Uh oh. Uh-oh, I've done it. Ah! Oh, a little bit left. And the rip. I have to glue the rip. Nearly there. Now I have to trim the edges should be done. <laughs> I just think my materials are too flimsy to work for long. But if it works for a few weeks, then I will invest in better materials and do it all over again. I cut a little bit of the tape to make sure that they're even. Make a nice round curve. Sticky already. Must be the sun. That's it. Let's see if it works. Promising. This will work. What I think of it so far? Don't know. I mean, it's not perfect. But everything that just comes flying past won't get in. Something that's crawling, good. But yeah, I have this thing 
don't know the name. That's just, without this, I'm sure it would work perfectly. And I don't know what the duct tape's gonna do in the sun. So I wanna leave this one out in the sun. But yeah, that'll make the van a lot cooler at night. And Timo will have tons of air. <laughs> I'm going to make another one for the other side and maybe one for the back. Testing out the new fly nets, they really do well. There's a lovely breeze going through the van. Super happy with them. Back home, I've used the fly nets in the blistering heat for a few days. They held up pretty well. Sometimes you get a little opening between the layers of tape. But overall I'm very pleased with them. When it's very hot the glue tends to melt a bit and then you can move the magnets. So when you take it off you have to be real careful. But I think they can last me a season and maybe more. So overall, great success. They're keepers. There was a lovely breeze going through the van. I opened the back up. Lovely. Timo was cool in the front at night. Fantastic. Try it if you have a van and you need something. 